What's up guys, welcome back to my channel today and I'm just going to show you how to play Love is such a fragile dance by Alec Benjamin. So I've called many of his songs in case you just want to learn any other. Uh, you can drop down down below, I'll provide you with the link or you can just check out my channel. Alright, let's get started guys. Let's start straight into the song. Uh, so this song is very easy to play. We need no cable for this song. We are in the standard tuning of the guitar. So let's have a look at the four chord shapes which you want to deal with the song. So first chord is the A major which is mute open, second, second, second open. <laughs> The next chord will be a F sharp minor, which is a uh, two on the E string, four four on the A and D string, and second fret on the G B and the high E string. Now you can play this chord uh, like this, which is a lot easy. Um, it's up to you. You can play bar, what do you want? But if you have any doubt regarding playing bar chords, I'll drop a comment down below. Okay. All right, D major chord. We have mute, mute, open, second, third, second. Which is uh, so we got D major, then we have an E major, which is 0, 2, 2, 1, 0, 0. So nice and easy chords. A uh, good news is we have the same chord progression going throughout the whole song. But I'm gonna show you some couple of methods to play it so that you can actually go different in different parts because it will kind of sound boring if you just go same throughout the whole song. All right, we know we have just finished up with learning the chord shape, but still, I like to show you some variation of the chords which are actually used in the song. I even so, uh, saw him performing live over here. Or oh, there he performs the chord something like this and all. Uh, he plays bar chords, but it's same as the open chords. Just he's playing bar chords. All right, so the variation of a chord used in the song is an A sus two, which is nothing, but it's actually mute open second second open open. So got second from the B string, gonna lift that off. And another uh, variation of the chord will be uh, this one, which is uh, my favorite, which is. So over here we got 2nd fret, 4th fourth, fret, fourth fret, 2nd fret, open, open. So F sharp minor, uh, so we have some 11 and all. I don't need to go to the name, but we have the E and the B string open. Again D major, you can just go for the high E string open. So it will be mute, mute, open, 2nd, 3rd, open. D sus 2. And then we have a E major, but I uh, shift from an E major 7 to an E major. It uh, sounds a lot confusing, but definitely these are much easier than the open chord shapes. It's 0, 2, 2, 2, 0, 0. So 0, 2, 2, 2, you can see like an A major shape all the way up. Alright, so the strength pattern for the verse on the intro goes like a Alright, uh, the chord progression for the whole song will be an A major, then an F sharp minor, then a D, then an E major. And maybe when we go to the chorus, we're gonna use the variation of the chord shapes. Alright, let's have a look at my right hand. It goes something like this. Kind of a little bit hard, but still I'm gonna break down the strength pattern. We have down, up, down, up, down, up. So see I'm doing down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. So we got down, up, down, up, down, up. Got it? And then we do up, up, down, up, down, up. So we got down, 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 up, up, down. Now the thing with the string pan, what happens is I also forget the original string pan of the song. So in case, what you're gonna do is you're gonna hear the song a couple of times. Believe me, guys, I also thought uh, a long time back how to play, how to do the string pan of the song, but it's all about your ear. You gotta hear the song a couple of times, and believe me, you can actually play the string pan on your own. You gotta need to hit the bits like one two three four when it goes to the guard down 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 up chicky chicky up up down up down up down down up down down up chicky chicky up up down up down see i got a mute over here up up down up down down all right so that's what's going for the intro and the verse so let's play one two three four the chorus uh, you can just go now 
Now what I'm doing is I'm replacing the normal open chord shape with the confusing name which are the version of the chord which is played in a more easy way I've showed you before. So you're gonna uh, put uh, A sus2, F sharp minor uh, with some 11 and all, uh, D sus2, E major 7, to a E major like I go then, 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 then. Got it? So now string pattern will be very down. I'm gonna go down very slowly, down, then I'm go up, up, down, up. So down, high E string up, B string up, down on the G string, up on the D string. I'm gonna repeat that on each chord. Just feel the string pattern, you get it. Up, up, down, down, and I can also do an additional down up at the end. Down, up, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, up, down. And in case if you have a bridge of the song, you can just go with one down each chord. Now the key to play the song is to hear the song a couple of times, and that will be okay. How this video helps you out? Don't want to make it super long because you know this song is very simple to play with some variation added. It will sound super good. Therefore, just practice this for a while, you will get it. Uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button if you're not yet. And I'll see you guys back in the next video. Check out the comments. Bye.